My grandma and your grandma sitting by the fire. My grandma said to your grandma, you don't set your flag on fire. Talk to that head now, head now. I go, I go, I met. Check him off in our hand, I met. Check him off in our bed. Look at my king all dressed in red. I go, I go, I met. But your five dollars is killing dead. Check him off in our bed. Talk to that head. They're all dying. I knew this car my whole life. Only drove it once. It's a 1949 Buick Roadmaster convertible. Only 8,000 production models made. Straight eight. Fireball eight. It's the first full year of the Dynaflow transmission. Know it by road. Whatever this is, I don't understand the point of secrecy. I mean, this patient is an old girlfriend of my father's. Mr. Babbitt, I knew your father since you were two years old. The year my mother died. Look, I'm trustee of the fund. But this hospital receives nothing from that. That hardly seems fair. Maybe that's something that we could discuss. I took on this burden out of loyalty to your father. That's where my loyalty ends. You know this car? I know this car. How do you know this car? I definitely know this car. It's 1949 Buick Roadmaster Straight 8, Fireball 8. Only 8,095 production models. Dad lets me drive slow on a driveway, but not on Monday. Definitely not on Monday. Who's your dad? Sanford Babbitt. Who? Sanford Babbitt? 10961 Beach Crest Street, Cincinnati, Ohio. Uh-oh. Huh? Hold, wait a second. Where are you going? 13 minutes to Judge Wapner, the Wapner. people's court. Hold it, wait a second here. I want to ask you a question. Which are Whitney's signals will be in. Participants are not active. Hey, I'm talking to you. Bruner, who is this guy? Raymond is your brother. The people's court. Hello, I'm Doug Llewellyn, and welcome to the People's Court. This is the case... What, he's crazy? No. Is he retarded? Not exactly. He's not crazy, he's not retarded, but he's here. Hello, I'm Doug Llewellyn, and welcome to the People's Court. This is the case... What, he's crazy? No. Is he retarded? Not exactly. He's not crazy, he's not retarded, but he's here. Well, saying is yes, then who's playing first? Yes, I mean the fellow's name on first base. Who? The fellow playing first base was St. Louis. Who? What are you asking me for? What is this? Why is he doing that? Who is on first? Whenever he gets oh, nervous, he does who's on first. You know, from Abbott and Costello? Yeah, why? Why? It's his way of dealing with you touching things. His books and stuff. first. So he memorized who's on first. Yeah, that among other things. Raymond, Ted Kluzewski. Kluzewski. Kozuski, Ted Kozuski, big clue, first base. Mm. This is a presidential right. suite. Yeah, dinner's at 6 30 p.m. Yeah, to the left is Raymond's room. Look at this big, beautiful room. This is a presidential right. suite. Go, go see what he's doing, will you? Ray? B-E-R-N, home. What home. is it, Ray, huh? What's happening, Holmes? 
Uh oh. Everything's fine. Are Charlie, let's right take him home. Come on. No, he's okay. Just get him some dinner. He'll be all right. What, what'd you say? You wanted hamburger? Raymond, what were you doing in my room? Hmm? Raymond, Raymond, what were you doing in my room? I don't know. You don't know what you were doing in my room? Of course, there were noises. There were noises. Well, those noises are none of your business. You understand that? Huh? Put the phone book down. Stop acting like an idiot and go to sleep. Hey, you hear what I said? Go to sleep. Go to sleep! Of course, it's 9 minutes to 11. Night's out at 11. Yeah, well, new rules. Go to sleep. Of course, it's nine minutes to eleven. Nights out at eleven. Yeah, well, new rules. That's it. Oh boy. That's it. You blew it. You don't get to see your program. It's finished. One minute to Wapner. One minute to Wapner. One minute to Wapner. One minute to Wapner. You. I had you in there, Ray. You were in there. Oh boy. What is going on out here? I'm sorry, ma'am. I like you. Shut me up. I'm very sorry about that. That man right there is my brother. And if he doesn't get to watch people's court in about 30 seconds, he's going to throw a fit right here in your porch. Now, you can help me, or you can stand there and watch it happen. And she sees an identical twin. True, he didn't have a shirt on. The other one did. But they sure look alike to me. If it got on his chest, he would have been doing blurred and got real cold. I know I put my hand on the dry ice in here. I wanted to take it off very quickly because it got very cold. Raymond. Raymond, remember that doctor asked you those questions today, the number questions? Yeah. How did you do that? I see it. Huh? I see it. What's that? Can uh, we stop that for a second? I see it. Rinse. Why'd you say... Why'd you say funny teeth? You what? said funny teeth, funny rain man. Rain man? Yeah. I said rain man? Yeah, funny rain man. Was I trying to say Raymond and it came out Rain Man? Yeah. Funny Rain Man. You? You're the Rain Man? Turn this off, will you, when you're not watching it? Yeah. You should run down the batteries. And where are you going to be at 3 o'clock when Wapner's on? Yeah, the red one always falls to stand. Why don't you listen to me? You just don't want to listen to me, do you? You want to go back to Walbrook? Is that it? Huh? I'm going to make a phone call.
Well, he's not catching the hold card, and he's not past posting this. I don't see him using a computer. Well, he's not, but something's not right. You know there's no one in the world can count at this six-deck shoot. Exactly what happened this past week, Raymond. Well, we we got oh, to know each other. I was asking other. Raymond. Raymond, what happened this past week? What did you do, Raymond? Counted cards. Counted cards. Counted cards in Las Vegas. Brother took you to Las Vegas. Three thousand dollars in real fortune. Gave you three thousand dollars to gamble with. Lost, lost three thousand dollars in pitiful, pitiful twenty. Uh -huh. And what else did you do? Had a number twenty. I don't know if I'm going to have a chance to talk to you again. Because you see, these, uh... Dr. Bruner really likes you a lot, and he's probably going to want to take you back with him. You know? Yeah. But I just want you to know that what I said about being on the road with you, I meant, you know, connecting. I like having you for my brother. I'm an excellent driver. Yes, you are. 